Hey guys, welcome to the video. So today we'll play the bonus mission of the Secrets of the Universe and also the Arcidius campaign. As you can see, it's actually listed as an Arcidius uh, mission. But first, let's listen to the 7.5 interlude, which will conclude the whole Arcidius campaign. And then we'll play the bonus mission, of course. Uh, so let's listen to this. Excellent, Rathenos, you have gained the power of the Chaos now for our master, the Dark Dreamer. You have earned yourself a place of honor among us. At last, we have successfully seized the unlimited power of the Tower. Now I can finally embark on my pilgrimage of death and devour all the worlds. Yeah, so Dark Dreamer was summoned and now he will devour all the worlds and that's basically what you'll play in this uh, bonus mission. Uh, I won't spoil anything immediately, let's listen to the opening animation and let's see what we have there. You can see we have two enemies, forces of uh, Redameria and people of Redameria. Daldrum fell and with it all of our Cetus. Now the power is in the hands of the Ageless Ones and the Dark Dreamer can finally be summoned. Now he can take revenge on all the mages in the worlds where the Fallen once lost. A few days later, Fallen attempts to take over another world, now with the help of the Dark Dreamer. The primary enemy is now the Guardian Mage Avius, who protects this planet in the city of Redemiria. Yeah, so we are in another world where we'll be fighting against uh, new enemies, but now the Dark Dreamer will be actually helping us. So well, let's wait for the quests. And as you can see, we need to defend our base for uh, from enemy attacks until the Dark Dreamer takes on the form of the Fallen, which is 15 minutes. We have a timer here and then we need to defeat the forces of uh, Redameria. So this should be pretty this easy. Of course, we don't have Niela anymore. Uh, we are we have to wait until the Dark Dreamer takes on the form of the Fallen. Let's not waste any time. Yeah, so we just need to uh, defend ourselves with Rathimos. Uh, our maximum population is 1000, so basically no population cap for us. Uh, we have those uh, those expansions in the underground, control forms, and we have a huge city with all the buildings in the light. Uh, new forces are coming through the Fallen Portal from the Realm of the Dark Dreamer, which is right here. So we have a Fallen Portal that will be summoning even more units for us every few minutes. So this is also I'm really good. Listening. As you I can see, we have all units oh, basically. So and enemy attacks will be coming from here. As you can see, there is a huge enemy town. Uh, there should be a bridge somewhere. Or maybe not a bridge, just the front of the town. And there is a lot of soldiers that will be attacking us. Uh, you cannot conquer the enemy town without the Dark Dreamers, you don't even attempt that. Attempt that. I'm listening. And uh, after 15 minutes, it's basically a free win. You just need to enjoy the power of the Dark Dreamer and just destroy everyone. Just one. Uh, I believe we also have all the researches already upgraded from the beginning. Uh, maybe not the floor uh, and towers, but out of that actually a few towers are upgraded here so that's good you can build a few more towers but uh, i think it's just better to invest into offense so i will build two more dimensional gates so we have five of them and then i will just produce ton of beholders i don't think it's really necessary to make avengers in this mission we might try it, but usually, usually beholders work quite fine in this mission. Yeah, so let's make a rally point somewhere. This world will be mine. Yeah, Ratimus is still the same strength, all the same abilities. All shall kneel before me. So yeah, nothing changes there for us. us. Uh, we have some matriarchs, that's really good. This world will be mine. Even some flying hive stingers. Some hive guards. And more. 
So let's make super group. I think I covered everything. And let's start producing those beholders. I mean, at enemy attacks will be quite strong, so maybe we should at, at least make some high speeders as well, and maybe even Avengers just for now. They will die later, but I just need something to defend myself for those 15 minutes. Yeah, it's not totally free, you still need to do some things. So it might be a good idea. But as you can see, here are those new forces that just came through that form portal, so we can add them to our army. So let's add it like this. I'm listening. I will oh, find so you before me. And so five. Yeah. Actually, I don't have space to make this sound. I'll just make a new group. of vengeance halls so maybe it quite it might be quite a good idea to make those avengers but i just really like the effect of being flying to it and i mean the others are just super super satisfying to play right now i don't really care what is what in my group together i just need something in the super group yeah if we cover all the 1000 population. I mean, you could also make like 1000 Hive Stingers yeah, and attack your enemy, but uh, I don't think you will be able to manage that. You still can have only 10 groups, which is uh, 150 soldiers. So uh, if you have 1000 Hive Stingers, you wouldn't be able to move with that too well. And it will be still super weak. Yeah, so, I mean, either make builders or rangers, doesn't really matter. Uh, five minutes already passed. I think the attacks will start coming now. So let's prepare for them by making few more beholders. And yeah, this mini luck that just mi uh, micro luck that just happened. Uh, I think that was the only coming. As you can see, out of the comments. That's also another reason why why I think it's a little bit better to make beholders in this mission because uh, you can just look at the with them and don't need to worry about uh, dying because they cannot attack you. But if you have Avengers, you can just give them a fight. Now they have some fight moves, but still they can just once again use them against Avengers. Another reason why I should make beholders. The only weakness of beholders are. Uh, crossbowmans and towers so of course towers can be countered by avengers but maybe they can manage it at least we need to try for ourselves i mean maybe we will run out of population but right now i'm not too convinced about it and i don't feel like making too many more summoners but maybe we can make few more in the underground like Three in each base, maybe three on the surface as well. We have a few more units. Uh, we are running out of gems, but I mean we have mineral fields and uh, gems mine as well, so cannot really speed it up too much. 
Uh, actually, there are some treasures in this map, I believe. We still have seven minutes, so let's try to explore it. Uh, I will use some hive guards for that. There is another echo. I cannot pick up those items me. with uh, flying to legs, so I will need to go there with Ratimus, but as you can see there is a orb. So I can just teleport haste. there, pick it up and then continue. Another orb is right here. Maybe there are some neutral enemies, I don't know. Even some resources here, extra life that you can use on, uh, even on uh, Dark Dreamer. A uh, ton of resources, definitely worth it to pick up. Uh, there are bears, but you can kill them with Ratimos or with flying units. Doesn't really matter. We have only five minutes left, so I need to start a little bit. Okay. I didn't just teleport away. Actually, I got stuck here. Ah. We cannot move through those trees. So, actually, I want to teleport away. I mean, I could kill him. He can't attack me, but I don't need to kill him, so I won't. I mean, you are getting new units uh, that don't care about population, so you can go over the population cap even. So, you can make like 2000 population, but why would you do that, of course? Dark Dreamer, of course. Uh, yeah, we got the orb so we can power up our hero. So it's easier to kill those bears and take our treasures. Seems like we can only get through here, so that is the tree. So I need to go around. Uh, another small bug after another five minutes, so that will be the second to attack. I will just uh, wait here to gems once again. Uh, there is actually, there are some rings that we can also use. I mean, there won't be too big of an effect. Dark Dreamer, so we can use some of stats. Let's try to something. Uh, now let's move to this area, where there are those resources. I At least they freed up some of my population. Our hero is on his way. There is probably nothing in our species. Actually, there is a wolf. We didn't get anything from him, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, there's just the wood pile, the gold statue, and uh, pile of gems. Let's just teleport to the mountains. Definitely want to get that ring. Unfortunately, we probably can't get there. We need to teleport. First, let's get rid of this bear. I have wood to hold, but I mainly want those gems that are. Once again, some attack. Oh, it's just demons. I didn't expect that. Once again, trying to move the new gem. I went to the new gem. I went to the new gem. I went to the new gem. 
shall not be beaten. No, let's teleport the year to the ring and then I will just teleport uh, to this gold statue. We can also pick up our scouts. Maybe explore a little bit more. So we know about all the areas. But eventually we'll either send them to die somewhere to spot even more or we'll just retreat to main army. It's really hard to move such a huge army and it's still only 400 population but I would still, I still like a huge army rather than just having small army that I can move but sometimes as you can see, out of here, I don't care about them. Uh, we have a lot of everything. I mean, I should probably say uh, for the RG. I already used one on Vratans, but it's really not a big deal. RG just don't need orbs. He doesn't need orbs. Uh, his strength abilities, you can use those and even though they can take such a super powerful that Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you want to go for this, if you want to go for this, if you want to go for this, if you want to go for but Make way. Mm -hmm. Here is one scout, as you can see, they have been cut up from here. Of course, uh, those are not going to shoot at you, but I shall not just to make it look a little bit better. None I mean, the Ramit Lisa Tower, the previous mission was really huge, but uh, it is even bigger and even more fortified. You wouldn't be able to destroy this with uh, regular units on the previous mission. You would only need that uh, army Yeah, then that, that's why we actually, based on the lore, attack on the cities because it was a really small world, as it was mentioned in the beginning. Uh, there was peace, no one was expecting anything. So it was really easy for us to defeat it. And now I'll show them the true power. It's good. We just can take the RGD here. 100,000 HP, 1,000 damage, and 100 armor. You can see also 4 abilities. Invulnerability, we have great missiles, so the large unit creates extremely powerful missiles that hits the target. Also, the one that seems to target damage on the powerful, and the great blast. The large unit creates an extremely powerful blast that hits the target, creates, uh, creating a shockwave that damages other nearby targets. Uh, this also damages your units, so be careful with that. I'm not sure if, sure if it actually attacks also flying units, but I love this uh, definitely try to use it carefully. And then we can summon skeletal warlocks, called 10 skeletal warlocks, to fight by the Dark Dreamless side for a period of time. Make which is actually way. quite long, I think it's like one minute or something. And that's uh, actually invulnerability and the summon is, are the only abilities that cost mana. Other two abilities have cooldowns and we have 1000 mana, so... This should be really easy. Now uh, let's use all the, all the things that we got. As, as you can see, the attack speed of Dungeon is also super, super fast. And also really fast. As you can see, I shoot it all the night and also part of my army. Uh, I can also use this to increase my army even more. Also, the mana regeneration is quite decent. We can use the extra life here. Orb of Lightning, oh, 20 more damage, me. and I mean 300, uh, I mean 300 more HP won't be too much, so let's just use that on Ratimos, maybe he'll survive a little bit longer. Oh, shall kneel before this world At this point, I don't think uh, it needs too much explanation, let's just take everything and destroy them. Oh, shall kneel before me, it will be mine. Because we can still keep producing more soldiers. You should not need it, but I mean, why not? They even have stingers. Actually, 
Actually, I intended to make video on Star Wars. I think I'm going to get a little bit of speed because that's totally brutal in combination with the damage. Early points somewhere around here. One thing I need to do is to make sure that this is not too much for me. I will just have to do my own thing. Maybe I will have to do my own thing. I will just have to do my own thing. I will just have to do my own thing. Forget that you are still receiving the units here. So I don't know why I summoned Dark Dreamer. I don't know why I summoned from this realm. We can probably make a few more dimensional gates. Which means uh, destroying all the enemies. You should have seen the other castle victory, which is quite dangerous. Oh, sorry, I just. Some more here, some more here. 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 Some more here.
As you can see, there are holy nice. Unfortunately, you cannot set a rally point from the dimensional portal, or the form portal where, where you are getting new units. So you just need to check it manually every few minutes to see if you received something new. I shall not be beaten. So let's continue here. Maybe I'll just back. Clear it a little bit before we go. Of course, I will shoot all the edges. It also wants to find powers. There should be the yeah, Lord of Lamea, it's not a sweet thing, it's a lot. Probably it should be more of a lot of it. I'm not just going to do this. Of course, I won't be sure, but it is probably a pretty decent damage to him. It's not a bad damage to him. Section, maybe the left side. Okay, I just prefer to destroy the right. The mage of ABS that we need to kill. And then my other exit is in the left part, so I'm going to go there. So let's just one shot them, of course. Uh, well, let's just one shot everyone. Three shots in the 
Nunchalapos. I don't need some more units, but they cannot attack me, so it's fine. Let's summon those units here. Attack of enemy knights, they are still attacking me even after all I did. Those might actually destroy my town because I'm not prepared for defending myself. I mean, those are not going to be able to Before army, it's no big deal. Oh, uh, there is no timer anymore, so you can just do whatever you want. I must be faced. Just I shoot those guys. There should be another belt. Be here it is. Dexterity that increases the attack speed. So good, we already have instant attack speed, and will be even faster. Oh, there is actually attack from the back. They are destroying the chamber of the Avenger. They will probably destroy it, but... This world will be mine. Uh, so let's retreat to the attack. Oh, actually I... I mean, I probably didn't use that belt. This world uh, will okay. be mine. Now we should have fast attack speed. Oh, there are some more production buildings. We also have really good range. Really good. I mean, he doesn't have any None weaknesses, so... Uh, I must None shall oppose me. I must make haste. None shall oppose me. I love this world. Yeah, so let's just fill up all the groups. I will once again make group number seven. We didn't have for a while because I didn't have enough units for that. They attack us. I love this world. Actually, some towers here, you can destroy them. From here, you can make some expansions. Make some extra expansions. Maybe you can just remove that, since you can just launch with everything. Now, let's just make sure there is nothing more in this area. This world will because there probably be mine. is. Out of my way. Our units are being destroyed. There will be probably some towers and buildings and definitely towers. Maybe actually some units uh, were created from here that went there. And there is lots of advanced barracks. So they needed to check this. I mean, the one annoying thing about Dark Dreamer is that he doesn't have teleport or Rathimus, which is something I probably got the used to, which would be a late. Uh, None shall nice. oppose me. Would be really nice to see those 
Je v pretty decent moment, shots. Don't really need to worry about it. We still have over half of it, so that's also good. And I think we already cleared uh, half, right half of the town. Actually, they just destroyed my town, okay. Uh, I mean, it doesn't really matter. Uh, you lose only if you use everything, and they would have to kill Argent Ring, of course. Try to save something. Uh, we still have those underground towns, and I don't think they have to be used. Fine, fine there. Uh, another one here. So we have some extra armor. Very good. So I mean, hey, it's still here. Maybe I will see the chance of how we have to do some damage. I'm in my way. Number 5 is quite empty. Oh, actually, we didn't clear this area. This is also the inner part where the main town was. The Lord. The Lord. Our units are being Try to rebuild this town. doesn't really matter. I mean, I had all the buildings here, so... I have a nice little technique that will make it so if I went here. A little bit sooner. I'm not sure if it's not me then. I'll be holding this here. It's really good, so I don't need to do that before I'm going to use it. I'm going to make it a little bit quicker, but here I'm going to be really careful. There is a ton of towers, yeah? This is the way that leads to the enemy tower. Maybe this mage is, so I'm going to just take a look at it, I'm going to be really careful there. Even here I'm going to be careful. I'm sorry. But we should be still receiving new units from the other portals. That's not really good. We can start rebuilding all the buildings. Maybe I can actually make... New harvesters in the other round. At least for the gems that we need. If I want to make more soldiers, we will need them. Now we're going to go. Maybe there's a... Great range. 
Maybe they are just standing here. But let's check it with the units we just received for free. Just need to make the doesn't work. Yeah, it's really, really weird. Okay, let's see the missiles. Yeah, here are the others. I don't know if I can this. I don't try. I will cross the bones. Serious diet and test of the material. None shall oppose me. Now I can use it. Maybe somehow bugger with the enemy. I will do it. Fine. They attack her. It works now, which is good. They just run through those towers. We do have at least three ones with three missiles. Nice. None shall oppose me. Attack. I'm provoked. And now I'll just destroy it. The best of the towers. We lost all of our armor. But we managed to destroy our enemy. There is one shot to the police. We can also send the total mages if they can take the rest. We can only use them to explore a little bit so I can see how many towers are there here. Before I actually need to so I must make haste. My the core core is 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 okay. Let's go to the area with him. Probably not. I think we did all of them, but you never know. I shall not be. I mean, of course, you don't want to destroy the uh, because uh, it's an invulnerable. It's another tower that will give the Dark Dreamer even more power. The city of Ramethaiza. This is something which is nothing to destroy. I cannot destroy. And now it seems like we destroyed everything, but we probably have something left somewhere. I don't know where. We just need to check. This is really bad that my army died because. I would definitely use all of those fine units and everything, but we are still receiving new units, so that's really good. We can just send those hive guards to everything, and hopefully someone will find something. Also, Optimus. Yeah, maybe there are some units somewhere around my town. I just don't know where should I look for those. Could be anywhere, yeah. Of course, this is the annoying part of missions where you need to actually destroy everything. Okay, so both, okay. I don't need to kill that. Uh, that. Okay. This world will be mine. Okay, something just died somewhere and we won. I don't know where it was, but just one unit probably somewhere. Uh, so yeah, we are victorious. Let's check the results. You can see uh, total score didn't even fit in this bar, so we cannot even see the line. Uh, here we have units. I mean, it's not. No, it's nothing crazy. Yeah? We just need to clear the town. So. 1380. I think maybe in some previous missions we had even more. So this is nothing too crazy, but of course uh, it was basically all killed by one unit. 
most of it. I didn't actually check how many units he killed, the Dark, the dark Dreamer, but uh, you can just take a look at the video a few minutes back. Uh, we lost actually quite lots of units because I was just wasting them there, but uh, it had no impact on every on anything. Uh, 100 units, nothing interesting, and uh, experience gate pretty decent. We actually destroyed 400 buildings, constructed 57, <laughs> lost 55. I didn't lose only those two dark fortresses in the underground. I was not too careful there, but if you build more towers, you will be really fine. And uh, since they don't cost gems, which is the only resource that you have problems with in this mission, then it will be really easy to defend against those eagles and probably even against those knights if you upgrade those towers and make enough of them. Uh, and then we have resources, definitely pretty decent. It was really close uh, with wood, but we still had a little bit more. I think we are harvesting wood even in the underground, so that's why. Or maybe only in the underground, I don't remember exactly. Uh, so yeah, this was the uh, the 8.0 bonus mission. Uh, and this is also the end of the series uh, Armies of Exigo, the Secrets of the Universe, because this was the last mission. There is nothing more, no more interludes. Uh, I mean, the RC, this campaign just ended that we uh, gained the power of the tower and uh, now the Dark Dreamer awakened, or we were able to summon him. He took the form of the Fallen and he is just destroying all the worlds uh, where he was defeated uh, hundreds of years ago. So yeah, this is the end of the storyline, I hope you liked it. If you have some feedback for this campaign, uh, let me know in the comments, of course, if you played it yourself, even better. That's why I make those campaigns, so people can enjoy them uh, themselves, but maybe someone just enjoy uh, it more when they watch me playing it, so that's also why I'm recording those walkthroughs, and also, of course, to show how to beat, it, beat each mission, because, may because maybe someone will get stuck somewhere and they don't know how to continue, so then they can just watch my video and... Uh, maybe get an inspiration on how to approach that mission in a better way. Uh, so yeah, we'll continue with some uh, next series, of course. I have something prepared, so don't worry, we'll continue. But uh, this is the end of this series, so take care, guys. <laughs>